Hey, what's going on guys? It is Josh Thomas here from the BitBlock and today in this style vlog, I'm gonna be showing you guys my current collection of Marc Jacobs sneakers. So I've been collecting Marc Jacobs shoes for like about a year now. I'm a little bit late to the party, but oh my goodness, this man knows how to design some very cool men's shoes. So uh, yeah, I've got, I don't know, I don't even know how many I have. I think about six pairs or so, I'm not sure. Let's jump into it. Let's start checking out my collection of Marc Jacobs shoes. Okay, so first up, we have these very awesome high tops. These are a, like a, I think a, like a royal blue shade. And as you can see, uh, they're pretty awesome. They've got a white sole. They've got the fancy golden Marc Jacobs logo on the side there. They have got some, little like steel colored eyelets where the laces go in. They've got laces that are the same color as the sneakers, as you can see, and uh, they have got a very high quality leather inside to them. And uh, yeah, I just really like these. These are actually a pair that I wear quite often. This is my wear pair, believe it or not. I actually have another pair of these that are like my museum pair that I don't wear. But even though I wear these, these are actually in very good condition. When you pay a lot of money for sneakers, I think you tend to take really good care of them. Actually, I take care of my shoes, even if I spent like 30 bucks on them, but uh, I really love these. These are very, very hot, very cool looking. They work with a lot of different types of clothing, and um, yeah. Uh, they're also kind of special to me because these were my first pair of Marc Jacobs sneakers. So uh, yeah, a little bit of a, little bit of emotional connection to them. Not really, I'm not that weird. But yeah, those are my first pair of Marc Jacobs sneakers. So these um, are actually the same as those blue uh, Marc Jacobs, but these are, as you can see, white. I probably don't need to tell you that. So these are the white version of those blue sneakers. Um, again, they are high tops and uh, they have a little Marc Jacobs golden logo there and uh, made of a very high quality material. And so yeah, I like these. Also, you know, little size on the toe there. Um, it's, it's weird, Marc Jacobs shoes tend to run bigger sizes than normal. So like these are a size nine, but they're actually kind of a little bit bigger than like a size nine in an Adidas sneaker. So like size nine in these, you can actually like, if you wear a size nine in other shoes, you might be able to get away with getting like a size, you definitely would be able to get away with a size eight in Marc Jacobs. That's just my own personal, my own personal experience, but uh, yeah, I like these a lot as well. These are, um, these go with more things than even the blue ones. These kind of work with literally any wardrobe you would want. They're of course leather. They're a good high quality premium leather look to them. So uh, yeah, I like these a lot as well. And then we've also got these. Um, these are also, it's so again, these are similar to the shoes that I just showed you, except they are a, um, they're not a high top, they're a low top. So um, they're in a gray tone, as you can see. Uh, it's a very, again, high quality leather. And uh, I really like these as well. Again, they go with pretty much anything. Um, really good laces, you know, and good little eyelets there and you know, really good style. I like these a lot. Um, and I've worn these a lot as well, but uh, they show very minimal wear. So yeah, low tops, Marc Jacobs. These were released, so all three that I've shown you here were released around the year like 2012, 2013, somewhere around there. Uh, unfortunately, you can't buy any of the shoes that I've shown you so far. And in fact, I don't know if you're gonna be able to get, find any of the Marc Jacobs sneakers that I'm showing you in this video. Um, but if you check out auction sites, that's generally a good place to find them. But with any designer sneaker, once they're gone, they're kind of gone. They release styles based on the seasons. So uh, kind of got to strike when you can get them. Um, so yeah. Moving on. So these guys right here are hands down some of my favorite sneakers that I own. These are amazing. These are definitely, I own like 150, more than 150 pairs of shoes. And these are definitely at the top of my list of some of my favorites. So um, as you can see, they are again a high top from Marc Jacobs and they are in a super glossy patent leather material and um, they are a copper color tone, kind of like a penny in a way. Uh, but a lot sexier and a lot fancier than a penny. And um, they are actually different from the high tops that I showed you before, in case you can't tell. One of the reasons is um, there's some more stitching, there's some more to the design, almost like stripes going down here. Uh, also, the eyelets are a, a white, a white tone. You know, they got like a white coating of paint over them. And uh, again, these are a size seven in Marc Jacobs. I actually wear like a size 10 
or a nine in Adidas, but like these are genuinely as big as a, a nine or a 10 in Adidas. So I really don't know what's going on with the sizing, but I fit into these perfectly fine. Uh, so I don't really think they are technically a seven. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, these are amazing. I love them. They are, whenever you're wearing these, they definitely own your wardrobe. No matter what else you're wearing with these, these are what people are gonna be looking at and asking you about. Um, so yeah, I do have to say one more thing though. So I'm gonna actually scoot out of the way here for a second because there's something very important I have to tell you guys. They make other, they make other color variations in these sneakers and literally the coolest pair of shoes that I have ever seen are right here. From Marc Jacobs, they are this model, but in a different colorway. And I have been trying to get them for like three years now, and I have had no luck. I stalk every version of eBay, eBay.com, eBay.co.uk, eBay.Italy, eBay, just all the Ebays, and they never pop up, even on eBay. I have checked Japanese auction sites. I go to bed every night feeling incomplete that I, Joshua Thomas, do not have what I would consider to be the ultimate pair of sneakers. It's, life is really hard. I have, I have so many problems to deal with, but that's the, the number one. Uh, so yeah, I love these, and I'd really like to one day finally find those red, white, and blue patent leather Marc Jacobs that are literally this, but in a different color tone. So uh, Marc Jacobs, or anybody from Marc Jacobs, if you're watching this and you wanna get in touch with me and help me find those sneakers, I will literally do anything. So yeah, um, this was a long, long segment, but I really like these. They're some of my favorite sneakers. They are super hot and uh, yeah. So for these, I actually own two pairs of these because um, they are very similar to the shoes that I really want, that I just talked about. So these are low tops from Marc Jacobs and they are a red, white, and blue color scheme as you can see, um, but they're low tops and they're kind of in the reverse color tone. So. Uh, the high tops have blue here and red here. So these are these are very close. I absolutely adore these. These are amazing. These are actually the pair that I don't wear. I'm realizing that now because they still have the paper in them. Uh, but yeah, these are super awesome. They are red, white, and blue patent leather low top sneaker from Marc Jacobs. Um, actually, let me grab the ones that I actually wear. So yeah, these are the pair that I wear. Again, they don't look any different from the ones that I just showed you, but um, these are so awesome. I love the color scheme. I love how bold they are. I love the shininess of them. Um, and yeah, like again, they, they go with a lot of things, believe it or not, even though they're kind of specific. They have sort of a patriotic feel to them, sort of a Captain America look to them in a way. Um, they have, what's really cool about these two is they have a suede outlining around the shoe in here. And this middle part is suede as well. It's like a um, kind of a, a grayish white color, um, but yeah. And it's also in the back as well. So I absolutely adore these. These are definitely, again, in my probably top five sneakers that I own. They are very amazing. I love them. And like I said, they are shoes so nice that I literally bought them twice. They were on sale when I got them. Uh, the second pair was on sale when I got them. I bought the first pair and I was like, oh my God, I love these so much. And then the second pair went up and I was like, I should probably have another pair of those because they're so amazing. So yeah, I don't know too many people that are crazy enough to buy two pairs of the same pairs of Marc Jacobs sneakers, but I have problems that I need to deal with. But I'm not gonna deal with them because these are amazing shoes. Okay, so um, this has been my collection of Marc Jacobs sneakers. Uh, I don't even know how many there were. I didn't count. There's also another pair of these blue ones that I just didn't have handy with me here. Um, so what I like to do in all these style videos, as many of you know, after I kind of introduce the shoes and uh, talk about the style a little bit, we jump into a segment where I kind of model off different uh, bits of clothing that look really cool with the sneakers. So let's move on to the modeling portion of this video. <laughs> all right, let's check out different bits of clothing that would look really cool with all of these Marc Jacobs shoes. Mm -hmm. 